Hi guys! You're watching the AppGeeker channel, and in today's tutorial, we're going to show you how to recover deleted photos on iPhone, with or even without a backup. Using the methods in this video, you can easily recover both recently and permanently deleted photos on your iPhone. Alright, let's get started. So, when you delete a photo or a video on your iPhone, it doesn't disappear from your device immediately. It moves to the recently deleted folder for 30 days. After 30 days, it will be removed from your phone automatically. The recently deleted album works like a recycle bin. If you delete some of your pictures and videos, and then change your mind, go check the recently deleted album first. So here on this iPhone, open the Photos app, and let's delete a picture from here. Okay, then, go tap the Album tab. And find the recently deleted album under the Utilities. If you don't see Recently Deleted folder, it means that you didn't delete anything in the last month or it has been emptied. Okay, tap Recently Deleted from here. And if you're using iOS 16 or later, it needs your passcode or face ID to get it unlocked. Apple's security policy. So, just do what it asks, and the recently deleted album would open. You can find all photos and videos that you've deleted in the past 30 days. If your deleted photos are here, just press it, and recover. Or, you can tap the select button at the top, and pick everything you want to get back. So, it's very easy to recover the deleted iPhone photos if you can find them in the recently deleted folder. But, if you're in another situation, let's say, if your photos are not here, not in the recently deleted album and not in your library, or if you accidentally tap the delete button when trying to recover them, you might think that these photos are gone forever, right? Well, actually, the deleted photos, and the photos removed from recently deleted folder, they still remain on your iPhone's internal storage until their storage are overwritten by new data. They are still on your phone, but the access to them is invisible. So to find the deleted photos hidden on your iPhone's internal storage, we're going to need some additional help from a third-party tool. Today we'll show you how to use an iPhone data recovery tool and recover your lost photos. So firstly, visit the appgeeker.com and locate the iPhone data recovery software page. As its name claims, this tool recovers a wide range of files that you consider permanently deleted and unrecoverable, such as photos, videos, messages, contacts, call logs and more. And it's very easy to use. We just need to install and open it on computer. I'll share the download link below this video, so you can get it easily. Alright, here I'm using a Windows computer. You can follow the same steps on your Mac. So open it and here we go to iPhone Data Recovery. As you can see, it's already on the Recover Form iOS device mode. So, now, connect the iPhone. Your device info will appear on the window if it's connected successfully. Then, hit the Start Scan button right here. For safe recovery, it needs your passcode to proceed. Alright, just enter the passcode and go on. Give it a few minutes to scan for deleted and lost files on your iPhone. Once done, all scanning results display on the window. As you can see from the left side, photos, messages, contacts, and other files. So, to recover the deleted photos, simply choose the camera roll, or other image categories from here, and on the right side, we can view all the pictures and select whichever to recover. It's very simple, just tick the checkbox, or deselect the ones you don't want, and then click the recover button at the bottom. Here you'll see a pop-up prompt. It's about to pick a local path on your computer and save all these photos that you just recovered from your iPhone. And that's it. No current data will be erased or replaced on your device. So, if you're interested, feel free to click the download link below and get your lost pictures back. Alright, if you have been using iCloud to back up your iPhone regularly, there's a good chance that your deleted photos are included in an earlier backup so that you can restore your iPhone from that backup and get deleted photos back. If you have no idea whether you have an iCloud backup or not, here's what to do. Open your Settings app, and tap on your Apple ID, then iCloud, iCloud Backup. If the backup this iPhone options is turned on, iCloud backs up your iPhone automatically when your iPhone is locked, and you can see the last successful backup with the date it was made. So, if this iCloud backup is made before you deleted your photos, what you're going to do next is to restore your iPhone from this backup. So everything in this backup, including the old photos and videos, will be downloaded back to your iPhone. But, there's one thing you need to note, that is this restoring process will overwrite everything you currently have on your phone. 
you will only get back what's in that backup, anything not included in the backup will be overwritten. If you don't want to take the risk, back to our last method. Alright, let's do the recovery with iCloud. So, to restore deleted photos and videos from an iCloud backup, the first essential step is to erase your iPhone. It's gonna wipe all current data and settings on the device. Like I said, the backup photos can be back, but everything added after that backup will be overwritten. Alright, go to the Settings app, and tap General. Scroll down and tap Transfer or Reset iPhone. Then, choose Erase All Content and Settings. It will need your passcode or Apple ID to proceed. So, verify yourself, enter your passcode and the erasing process should begin. Ok, just wait patiently. When it's done, the phone restarts automatically and displays the Hello screen. Now, go through the setup steps quickly until you reach the Apps and Data screen. In iOS 17 and later, it should be transfer your apps and data on this screen. So now, choose to restore from iCloud Backup. Then sign into your iCloud account. Enter your Apple ID and password so you can access your iCloud backups. And from this list of your backups, make sure to choose the one that contains the photos and videos you want to restore. Keep in mind that this process will download and restore everything from your iCloud backup to your iPhone. If you just want your photos back separately, the first two methods may be more suitable for you. And if some of you guys prefer to back up iPhone with computer, like with iTunes or Finder, you can also use it to restore your deleted iPhone photos from iTunes. So, on your computer, launch the iTunes and connect your device. If asked, enter your passcode on your phone and allow it to trust your computer. And then, on the upper left corner of iTunes window, click this phone icon to access your device. Alright, scroll down a little bit, in this backup section, you can easily find the restore backup button. So, click this computer, and hit the restore backup button to retrieve your photos and everything else stored in it. From the pop-up selector, choose the most relevant backup to restore your iPhone. After that, all backup files will get back onto your iPhone. However, similar to the iCloud method, you'll lose all data added since that backup. So make sure the deleted photos really matter a lot, or you'll lose the most recent data. Alright, these are 4 ways to recover deleted iPhone photos with or without a backup. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. If you did, we really appreciate a like on this video. If you've got more question, please let us know in the comments. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.